What's up, YouTube? It's me and Brank's name, or Pick Crafters, and today we're going to be doing another. I don't know why it flipped, but today we're going to be doing. I don't know why it keeps flipping. Stop flipping. We're going to be doing a Humberto, or Tropical Storm, Humberto, Hurricane Kiko. Stop flipping. Tropical Storm, Humberto, Hurricane Kiko, and Typhoon Papai. No, not, not Papai. What the heck? I meant Paypa. I mean, that's how Force 13 pronounces it. So, I'm just going to roll with it. You know what? It'll just be on this. Since it likes to flip like that. So, anyway. Humberto is currently 210 miles away from the uh, the uh, Abaco Islands. The same place where Dorian hit. And also, and also it's about 170 miles from um some place in florida i don't know what it was i don't know how to pronounce it but it was like 170 miles we'll just say 170 miles away from florida so humberto uh i would say the only place it probably would really hit at this time is bermuda uh probably same place where andrea hit in may um it's supposed to be a category one but on tuesday it's going to be a Category 2. Winds with 100 miles an hour. And then as it goes in the day, still Category 2, 110 miles an hour. And then still going to be Category 2. It could be a major hurricane. We don't know. But that's always something we need to look out for. Here's the satellite image for Humberto. It's actually looking really organized. Um, I haven't checked the satellite uh, view in a couple of days. But, um, National Hurricane Center still says it's a tropical storm. It looks like a very powerful tropical storm. And it is. Because National Hurricane Center is, um, just expecting hurricane status. Um, and it is a strong, strong tropical storm. Could be, uh, become a hurricane tomorrow. Uh, yeah, probably tomorrow near the models for Humberto. Uh, the most inaccurate one, I would say, is the NVCI, the orange one, the COTI, there's just a bunch of them, C-E-M-I, just a bunch of ones that I don't think is accurate. The one that I think is most accurate is the uh, this one that heads all the way over there. Hopefully you know what I'm talking about. Huh, get out of here, Facebook. I said get out. Uh, here's Hurricane Kiko. Uh, it's actually a major hurricane at the moment. Um, hurricane Kiko it has been a hurricane in the Pacific for a couple days now. Um, it's uh, definitely going to be weakening in the next few days to a tropical storm. Here's the satellite image, as you can see. Just a little eye right there. Not a little eye, it's big because, you know, if it's little, that means like it'd probably be one of the strongest on Earth. I'm just kidding. Not the strongest, but it would be really strong. That's what I'm trying to say. Like, Dorian's eye is really, really small. Um, although, yeah, it does look very organized. Here's what the National Hurricane Center thinks. Exactly what we think. Uh, tropical storm. Probably, w when do I think this is going to end? Probably on Saturday or Sunday is when I think it's going to end. So, we'll just see and look out for that. Holy crap, there is a bunch of unlikely models. <laughs> Most of them are unlikely. The most that I think would be likely is that uh, the black model right there, the, the OFCI model. Yeah, very unlikely for me. Oh, wait, did I show this out? Right? Yeah, I think I did. And here's Typhoon uh, Pipa, as you can see, moving up north. Well, actually, it's moving. 26 uh, degrees north and 142 degrees east. I should probably start saying that, shouldn't I? Um, it is currently moving around 24 miles an hour very fast. As it does move north, though, it's definitely going to weaken. We're not expecting anything strong out of this storm. Definitely not. Just no. Uh, for some reason, it's not providing me a satellite image, so. Can't really show one of Peepa today, but maybe tomorrow. 
next update tomorrow. Uh, I will see you guys for another update tomorrow. Bye. Peace out. Have a great day.